They took uh, two years off, and now a big beer-based party is making a grand return. After being aged in a fine oak barrel, John Dabkovich is standing by to learn more. <laughs> John yes, has been aged. Uh, unlike fine wine, though. I have not aged well. Uh, guys, we are joined by our friend Robin Gregory from Sierra Nevada. She's here talking about they have something called Beer Camp, which is coming up. Now, I don't like camping, but this sounds awesome, Robin. Explain for us what is Beer Camp. Well, John, I hope you are doing your stretches because Beer Camp is back. Beer Camp is, <laughs> beer camp is an adult day camp with activities like human foosball, keg bowling, capture the flag, a ropes course, a rock wall, human hungry hippos, axe throwing, which is new this year, mm -hmm. and many others out at our brewery here in Chico. Um, there's also more than a dozen food trucks and lots and lots of beer. Uh, you mentioned human foosball. I, 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 mm -hmm. My first thought is that sounds like soccer, but I'm guessing it's not. No, if you if you can imagine the foosball table that you might yeah. see at a bar with the little uh, handles that you move, just imagine that instead of little dolls on the handles, those are actual people. Wow. Um, it is. It, oh, there, there it is. is. You can see it on the screen. Oh, right. yeah. oh, there it is. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love oh, it. Look at that's the hungry hippo. Human <laughs> hippo. It is. It is everything that you could imagine. It is uh, a ridiculous, so probably our most ridiculous event and probably our most fun event. So this is back after two years, uh, presumably because of the pandemic. Uh, as you know, the pandemic was a weird time. Uh, you sat here and watched me chug mustard that you guys had sent in. Um, I'll never forget it. <laughs> now, uh, judging by my habits during the pandemic, I'm assuming Sierra Nevada uh, beer sales were pretty much fine. But how important is it for you guys to have these in-person events again at your facility? We are so excited to have people back at our facilities. Um, as you mentioned, yes, we have not had any large scale events since 2019. This is the first one back. Um, and we are just pitching to get people back through our doors. Um, it's good for the community. It's good for us. Uh, beer is all about being together. And so we cannot wait to be together again. Uh, I'd like to point out that those boring folks at Anheuser-Busch, they don't have any fun events going on at their <laughs> place. Uh, okay, so it is it is May 14th and 15th. Is the 14th That's sold correct. out, though, correct? 14th is sold out. Saturday is all sold out, but there are still Sunday tickets available. Uh, they start at $35, which includes your first beer, I should mention. Mm -hmm. um, and it is an awesome day out at the field. Um, we have shuttles from downtown Chico to make sure that you get there safely. Um, it's a blast. And Come local food trucks, all that stuff. So it's like a whole day of it. It's a whole day. It's a whole event. Uh, we have an early an early riser ticket if you want to come in an hour early. We have a group con costume contest. So get your friends together and you could win. All right. Tickets are available. We have all the information on our website, gooddaysacramento.com. Robin Gregory, thank you so much. Good to see you. And have fun at beer camp. Thank you so much, John. We'll hope to see you out right. there one day. How could you not have fun? All right, guys. All right, more good day coming up after this little beer break. And they're done with that foosball thing. Can we do it? Yeah. <laughs>